we are the loneliest society there's ever been. There's a study that asks Americans, how many close friends do you have who you could turn to in a crisis? And when they started doing this years ago, the most common answer was five. Today, the most common answer, not the average, but the most common answer is none. I spent a lot of time talking to an amazing man called Professor John Cassiopo, who's the, who was the leading expert in the world on loneliness. He was at the University of Chicago. And he explained to me, why are we alive? You and me and everyone watching this, why do we exist? One key reason is that our ancestors on the savannas of Africa were really good at one thing. They weren't bigger than the animals they took down. They weren't faster than the animals they took down, but they were much better at banding together into groups and cooperating. Just like bees evolved to live in a hive, humans evolved to live in a tribe. And if you think about the circumstances where we evolved, if you were cut off from the tribe, you were depressed and anxious for really good reasons. You were in terrible danger. You were about to die. Those are still the impulses we have. We are the first humans ever in the long two million year history of our species to try to disband our tribes. Thank you.